Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. ago detectives say this tampa mother was killed by her boyfriend john mcqueen now he is on trial for her murder fox 13's gory gomez explains tonight how prosecutors used his chilling words against him i just did it to shut her up she was going to try to make my life a living hell i told her i'll kill you you keep bothering me i'll kill you and he did Lead prosecutor Aaron Hubbard says John McQueen is a cold-blooded killer who thought his girlfriend, Kalena Atkins, was a problem, so he got rid of his problem. She tried to scream when I first put my hands around her neck, which made me squeeze tighter. That's the graphic evidence the jury heard during McQueen's murder trial. You swear or affirm any testimony you give in this proceeding will be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, so help you God. Yes. Thank you, ma'am. They also heard from McQueen's now ex-wife. She was married to him at the time of the murder and says that day, McQueen called her and confessed. He told her the two were arguing about a tattoo McQueen has of his wife's name. Atkins wanted it gone. Do you know Mr. McQueen? Um, he's my husband. She told the judge about it during a bond hearing nearly two years ago. He said that... Um, that she tried to come in with a knife because she was going to carve his name, my name, out of his arm. He said that he, he finally snapped. The defense echoed that same theme. They argued he snapped. This wasn't premeditated first-degree murder. They pushed for a lesser charge of second-degree or manslaughter. In your mind, give Mr. McQueen the same dignity and think of him as a human being, as a man, as a man who is presumed innocent. But that was a tall order since McQueen confessed to the whole thing. Prosecutors say he had no regrets. In fact, he gloated about it. I knew she was going to keep f***ing with me. You can only poke the bear so much. Gloria Gomez, Fox 13 News. Now, after hearing all the testimony today, the jury returned a verdict, and that verdict, we understand, is guilty, in fact, of first-degree murder. McQueen will now be sentenced next month. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.